Hello everyone and welcome to my young and restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Young and the Restless teaser video for the week of April 29 May 3 indicates that Ashley Abbott's mental health problems would be addressed by Alan Laurent, but Belle has other ideas. Belle will try to make Ashley forget about Tucker McCall by making her feel as though she needs a new partner, so she'll flirt with Alan in an attempt to ignite a romantic spark. Alan will naturally feel uneasy about it and be want to reassure Ashley that they are still friends, just as they were in Paris. Belle responds, but there's an agenda, in the weekly preview video for Vi and R. Maybe Belle will admit that Tracy Abbott's worries are what brought Alan, but she'll act like her sister is exaggerating. Nevertheless, Belle will tell Alan that she's happy to see him and that she hopes this may be the beginning of a hot new relationship. Alan hopes to speak with Ashley in person at some point to confirm that she does, in fact, suffer from dissociative identity disorder. Ashley ought to receive the necessary medical attention as a result of this. Together with Cole Howard and Victoria Newman, Amelia Heinel, they will find a clue that may lead to the whereabouts of Claire Grace, Haley Aaron. Victoria and Cole are shown carrying a doll that Jordan may have left behind at her motel hideout in the Y and R weekly preview clip. Cole and Victoria are going to open the doll from the back because there will be something inside. Hopefully, the information contained there will make some connections and prepare the way for Claire to safely return home. Melody Thomas Scott's character Nikki Newman will have a drunken breakdown at the GCAC, leaving a suite completely wrecked. Jack Abbott, Peter Bergman, will investigate the tragedy site and find out what transpired once he eventually persuades Nikki to let him inside. Perhaps Nikki won't be able to handle the guilt of Claire's possible permanent disappearance. It's possible that Nikki's plastered outburst was caused by her mounting concerns that Victoria might lose her daughter once more. Of course, Jack will try his hardest to reassure Nikki and pull her out of this dark hole. Given all the doll-related things we've been discussing, Nikki ought to hear some exciting news soon. Don't miss a second of the action. Our forecasts indicate that Claire will shortly undergo a spectacular rescue. At the GCAC, Nikki Newman, Melody Thomas Scott, will have a drunken meltdown that leaves a suite in absolute shambles. Once Jack Abbott, Peter Bergman, finally convinces Nikki to let him inside, he'll see the disaster area for himself and ask what happened. Maybe Nikki just won't be able to cope with the guilt of Claire potentially being gone forever. Nikki's plastered outburst, may be the result of growing fears about Victoria losing her daughter all over again. Naturally, Jack will do his best to reassure Nikki and lift her out of this pit of despair. Based on all the doll developments we mentioned, Nikki should get updates on some good news in the not-too-distant future. Our predictions point to Claire's dramatic rescue happening soon, so don't miss all the action. The young and the restless spoilers say Victoria and Cole will do whatever it takes to make sure Claire has a happy homecoming. According to teasers for the young and the restless, Victoria and Cole will stop at nothing to ensure Claire has a joyful return home. Young and the restless teasers indicate that Victoria Newman will feel both fear and hope after Claire Grace's phone call in the episode that airs on April 25. Jordan's nightmare will continue, leaving Victoria feeling torn. Victoria will be somewhat glad that she finally heard Claire's voice because she had been worried that Jordan's plan of retaliation would have killed Claire. This is the first sign of life Victoria has had throughout the entire process, so she should be grateful for it. Victoria should be worried too, since it was clear Claire needed help and was trying to get in touch with her mother. That will alert Victoria to Claire's need for immediate assistance due to whatever situation Jordan has put her in. Victoria would admit that she could barely hear Claire on the other end of the line to Nikki Newman, Melody Thomas Scott, and Cole Howard, J. Eddie Peck. 
Claire was unable to provide her whereabouts, thus not much information may be provided. Claire might, of course, try again over the phone. Even if the connection isn't any better the second time, Claire might be able to say a few more words that could indicate where she is. Perhaps Victor Newman might help by requesting his staff to investigate and try to pinpoint the exact location of that call. It's possible that Jordan locked Claire away somewhere, from which she has only recently managed to break free. Claire has succeeded in obtaining a phone, although it appears that the service is subpar. Victoria and Cole are desperate to find their daughter, even though it would make the search for Claire more challenging. We'll explore what Harrison Abbott can do to help Kyle Abbott with the Claire hunt by giving him some information to give to Cole and Victoria. At the very least, Harrison's confirmation that Claire was the victim in all of this and not Jordan's accomplice is praiseworthy. Although Lai and our viewers knew from the start that Claire had been abducted, the characters still needed an explanation. As a clandestine captive, Jordan may be able to provide Victor with some information regarding Claire's current whereabouts. Either way, Victoria and Cole may have to take the initiative to save Claire. Claire is going to find out just how much she can trust Cole and Victoria, her parents, when it counts most. Maybe Victor Newman might assist by asking his team to look into and try to determine the precise location of that call. Jordan might have imprisoned Claire in a distant location, where she has just now succeeded in escaping her constraints. Claire has managed to get her hands on a phone, but it seems like the service is awful. Although it may make it more difficult to find Claire, Victoria, and Cole are determined to find their daughter. We'll see if Harrison Abbott can provide Kyle Abbott with some information to relay to Cole and Victoria in order to aid in the Claire search. Harrison's confirmation that Claire was the victim in all of this and not Jordan's accomplice is, at the very least, commendable. Fans of Y and R were aware that Claire had been kidnapped from the beginning, but the characters required some explanation. Victor might be able to get some information about Claire's current location from Jordan, who has taken up residence as his covered hostage. In any case, Victoria and Cole might end up taking the lead in saving Claire. It appears that Claire will see how much she can rely on her parents when it matters most, Cole and Victoria. Stay in for more predictions on the remainder of the kidnapping chaos, as spoilers for the young and the restless indicate that Claire will find a way out of this situation. Expect additional guesses about how the abduction may play out, as reveals from the young and the restless suggest that Claire will manage to escape. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.